Welcome back guys to some more Red Dead Redemption episode number 24. 24 episodes. My god. Right, another mission. Let it begin as we slowly stroll towards it. For purely scientific purposes. Ah, Marston, sir! It's good to see you, old bean. Good to see you. And you too, Professor. Forgive me. I am in a state of remarkable agitation, partly due to standard narcotic impulses, but also due to the fact that I have finally solved the riddle that has tormented my mind these past eight years. What's that? The nature of the savage soul! What makes some societies great, like ours, and others, uh, yeah, not worse. I would never use a pejorative such as worse, but, 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 but lesser! Meaning? Meaning. What makes these beings less human than us? Closer to beast on the continuum between animal and god! You know, I argued with Fortescue at Yale about this. It caused a minor scandal. But I shall be proven right, sir! I shall! Mark my words! I shall show them all what civilization is all about. The redskins and the knobs at Yale. Come, sir! I have a way to save both our desires. I will bring you, Vanderlint and me, the evidence of savages reverting to type! Come, sir! Where the devil is the stars? He should be here with the horses. Where is he? Where is he? I don't know where he is. Is that, is that the horses? Beating like a drum. Try to calm down, calm Professor. Down. There's no horse. I've never Let's go. so excited in all my life. Hello, Professor. Mr. Marston. What were you talking about back there? Where are we going? Let's go! Don't take back there like a wet blanket! What the heck is going on right now? I have no idea what's going on. Explain yourself! I'm actually a little nervous, I have to say. The <laughs> touch of the old jitters! No kid! It's no small relief to have the two of you along with me. Especially you, Nastas. You really have made remarkable progress in the short time I've known you. I'm glad you have found it useful. I've always been a little afraid of savages, if I'm honest. But your mastery of basic English and openness to rational discussion is nothing short of reassuring. You see, all those years of research were worth it. Isn't it fascinating? I've actually noticed that your skull is very Caucasian in form. I must have a prod around in it sometime. I'd rather you didn't. So many questions. Have humans evolved into competing subspecies? Why is the white man civilized more quickly? Why does the stuff here dance for rain and sacrifice deer to a myriad of false idols? You're starting to... The bear! Oh. Shoot it! Shoot it! Is that, is that going to kill that? Right, fair enough. Another bear will be killed. By my hands. Oof. No? I thought he was still alive then. My God, that was terrifying! And I say we leave before any of its friends turn up! Might be wise. Yeah, I'm tempted Sunday, to stop and skin it. To miss the meeting. My goodness, I'm still shaking! What a ferocious animal! That bear showed no signs of aggression. If we hadn't shot first, it most likely would have ignored us and moved on. All very well for you to say, but perhaps you have some kind of primal bond with these animals. But I, sir, have nothing but my innate instinct for self-preservation. Here we are. This looks like a trap to me. Hmm. I'm not sure about this. Not sure at all. What do now is get my revolver out. So we are not revolver, sorry. It's my pistol. Howdy. Hello, gentlemen. We come in peace. Those words mean nothing coming from people like you. Look at what you've done to us. Look at us! We live like animals, scrabbling in the dirt. Well, I... Well, but I... Well, violence isn't the answer. Maybe you live in a different America than we. Men like Vanderlint will lead you to disaster. I think we've already experienced disaster. The likes which you could only imagine. Put your hands up! We come in peace! What was he says, Marston? You call this a meeting? Give me your damn weapon. This is not what we agreed to. You shut your mouth, you treacherous snake! Oh, Holy shit! What? Touch! Professor, get down now! Did that just happen? They just shot him? The that is bad! That is bad! 
That is very, very bad. We're gonna die as well, bitch. Oh, this pistol's so good. You have to get us out of here. Still like this shit. Stay down and keep Stuff quiet. Behind the box. But there we go. Behind the head. That guy was still alive. Whatever you do, please. Reloading. Give me two seconds. Is that bear in the background? Can that bear help us out? Oh, nice. I knew it was a trap. I knew it. Oh, the blood. The chaos goodness. That makes no sense. Let's see it, kill him. What was she in the background? I shot something. Okay, it's not working right now. Dead. And it might be it. Oh, man. I mean, it's pretty I clear it was, a, a, tra was a, a very rough meeting, at least. We just walked in there. Hands up in the air. That went badly, badly wrong. Badly, badly wrong. Excuse me, mister. I mean, they are Dutch's gang, so... I think we're good. Let's go. Let's get out of here. This is not a good place to be. We're going, we're going, we're going. Come on. Let's go. Oof. Jesus. That was tense. We should move quickly. There's plenty more where they came My from. My God, I feel terrible. My head is pounding. Getting shot at will do that to you. I'm completely drained. It's like my body is aged 10 years. Uh -oh. oh my god, that's uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Is he dead? He, he can't be dead, surely. Ooh. That guy's still alive, I think. No, nope, he's still alive yet. Shoot you and shoot you. Oh. Yes, we are friends. What happened to that guy? Four times. Yeah. There we go. Now he's dead. Good. Well, I guess this completes my research. Finished. Done. Complete. Ship the book with one sentence. The savage mind cannot be civilized. We got ambushed by Dutch's gang. It's a little soon to be drawing conclusions on an entire people. Oh, this is very shit. Not again. I'm fucking shot him, I should be honest. She's surprised me. Whoa, they're right next to us. We can help fairly quickly. Oh, nice couple of shots there. Oh. I think we're safe, just about. The help was bad there. We went straight into him, like, directly. They were firing all cylinders. Come on, Professor. Get you back to Blackwater. I'd appreciate safe. it if you would, Mr. Marston. I'm a shadow of my former self. He's been shot as well. Look, see the blood on the back of his shirt. He's actually—he does shoot though. He does actually shoot back, which is surprising. Oof. Tense. Tense, tense mission. I like, this game seems to just wipe out like big characters in the game, just in an instant. Like, like nothing. Like, like they don't exist. Just snap the fingers and they're gone. Pretty crazy. You back yet? We're back. Whew. Oh my god. Safe and sound. Thank the Lord. So much for a meeting of minds. Thank you, Mr. Marston. I could be boiling in a pot right now if it wasn't for you. Get some rest, Professor. Whew. Right, I think it's time to another mission. Because that was, that was a fairly short one. Shortish, anyway. But we should have another one with, with him. Mr. Professor. If he's available. Come back between 9pm and 5am. Okay, fine. We'll ignore that one then. I really got a mission with the agents. Is it Agent Ross. Great men are not always wise. That, that, that is true. That is very true. What a pleasant surprise, Mr. Marston. An informer just told us some interesting news. Our mutual friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, is about to pay call on his bank manager. What do you say to having a little financial discussion with the fellow? This way. Let's get up on the roof. We'll have a clear shot at them from there. So who's the bigger crook? These uh, agents or John Marston? I, I don't know. <laughs> That's um, yeah, interesting question. 
cool is ooh, it's ammo. That door is the only nice. way in and out of the building. So cover it tight. Do you see those horses to the left by the building across the street? Dutch's boys hitched them there. They'll have to run that way to make their escape. Don't start shooting until they're out in the open. If we spook them, they might retreat back and hole up inside. Don't shoot till I give you the signal. Keep your sights trained on that bank door. All right, understand. Is there a gun? Is there just ammo behind us? I think so. Nobody shoots until I say. Someone's coming out. Gun arm. Hold your fire. They shot him dead. Whoa! You shit. Gun them down. Oh, missed. Wow, my shooting skills at one point as usual. Kill him. Take him out. Through. Where are they? Are they on the top of there? Oh, nice shot. Back through the chest. Ooh. So what's he doing? Is he like robbing the bank or just... I don't know. See them running through the bank? Take them out! Where are they? Is that one there? Oh, nice. Through the window. Hard to see them sometimes. Oh, there's one. Oh, right in the leg. Is there one there? Oh, they're coming out. Oh, they're coming out. That's bad. All oh, right in the back. They're Shit. making a break for it. Keep shooting down. There's still one more. Oh, is that a horse? Let the horse get there. Yes. It's dead. No. Nope. Die, little shit. I just shot a tree. They're making a break for it. Nice, that should be all of them. Woo! Marston, head into the bank with Hopkins and Manny. Get Dutch. Be careful. There may be some innocent people there. I think mean, Dutch is in there. I don't think so, anyway. We can take them! So there's still I some more inside. Should I go for a shotgun? Haha! <laughs> I like the sound of that. Marston, shoot the door open. Jesus Christ! It's open. Oh, there's a bunch in there. Help me! Please! Now, heated. Oh man, a shotgun is awesome. Oh, there's a civilian there. Dead. One more. Ooh. Reload, come on. Whoa! How'd he survive that? No! Please! This guy just keeps taking it. Where did all these fools come from? I ain't gonna tell Die, you! Die, little fool! Right, now he's dead. Right, let's switch to my pistol. And try. Take this guy out. No, I'll do that. The civilians will die. Very careful here. Yeah. Right, I can just take him out. Don't move. Oh, what a here. shot! Head to the town hall. You really want to die? Good Apparently work. so. Dutch Apparently, I don't think Dutch is up there. I'd love if he was. Oh, it's a friendly. Sorry. Ooh. Right. You shot. You're gonna get shot. What? What I hear? Oh. That's it. That's so powerful. I mean, it's called a high power pistol. It does make sense. Dutch. Oh, it's nice to see you, John. Hello, Dutch. To shoot him. How's Abigail? Well, I hope. Ain't seen her for a while. Because you've been chasing me? Let the woman go, Dutch. Dutch. Of course. Of course. How's your little boy? He ain't so little now. No, he must be what? Fifteen? Sixteen? Doesn't time fly? Don't adjust. It's over, man. Of course. Of course. I surrendered, John. You're the master now. I've been my master since you left me to die. We all make mistakes, John. I never claimed to be a saint. But equally, 
I never took you for an errand boy. Just trying to help my family, Dutch. By making compromises, we all have to. Now let her go. It's over. You want the girl, John? You always were the romantic sort. You know, gentlemen, this man here, oh, he married a whore. Used to ride with us. We all had her. Oh, but he married her. And you know that makes him a better man than us. He's a better man. Have the girl, John. Easy, Dutch. She's a parting gift from me. Jesus! God damn! Hurry up! The Dutch is leaving! Holy shit! Where's he gone? I don't see him! What the hell happened in there? This is your fault, Marston! You got a gun too, Sheriff. You waited too long. Next time I'll just shoot the girl. That's Where's enough. my horse? Come on, let's find the bastard. Go! Ah, Dutch is getting way. away! We must catch up. Yeah. Well, he's not getting away this time. I guarantee it. Hey, We've got the mighty fine steed. Sub and I will chase him down. He stole off from the bank manager in an automobile. Let's just say, Dutch ain't gone and got himself safe. Killed some poor woman. There's an old logging camp further down this road. It's been abandoned for years. My guess is that's where they're headed. Come on, follow me. How do you get away so quickly? Like he literally just killed a, a woman so and just ran away. The great Dutch. What a role model. The man who made you who you are. I guess so. Has he changed? No, still the same crazy bastard he turned into. How was it seeing him after all this time? Did he tug on your heartstrings? Kind of reminds me of you, a violent piece of shit who went and confused himself with God. Isn't that sweet of you? And now you must kill him. Your side is chosen. My side ain't chosen. My side was given. I'd kill you a hundred times before I killed Dutch, if it was an option. Hallelujah! I think we're finally reaching an understanding, Mr. Marston. Who the hell are you fellas anyway? Mall men or army? We are neither, Mr. Marston. But I have the authority over both. You bastards can't ever give a straight answer, can you? Is this the car? The car. They must car. it and continue on foot. Head into the forest. That's what I'm doing. Let's catch up with the pack. Jesus, where are these guys coming from? Ah, went too far. You assaulted the sheriff. Oh, look, they're all, there's a whole bunch of the gang here. One dead. And I love this new pistol. It's so good. I think I'm still alive. I shot him so many times. Ooh. Okay, well, I can't do any friendly fire. It's sometimes quite hard to tell the difference. Let's go. Like behind that rock. And boom. Ooh. Good damn, motherfucker. Absolutely dead. This pistol's so good. So you don't need any other gun anymore. It's just this pistol. One's more up here. Boom! But it's like, oh, nice. There's still a few more left, guys. There's no idea. Definitely not over. I don't even see where the hell they are. Oh, there's one on the left. Wait. Did you before? I think pretty dead. I think pretty dead. <laughs> I think there's one more left though. That's it, you little stooge. Getting some cover, get my health back. Who are you running to? Try and kill him. Try and go for a headshot. Doesn't work. Doesn't work at all. I'll try and flank him. Flanking is always good. Boom. Guess who's here? Guess who's flanking you? Oh man. Oh man, that flank worked perfectly. Dead. Toss his hat. It's gonna be a good sign. Right, meet the agents. Just gonna nick some monies. 
Well, that was interesting. Unfortunately, Dutch on, has gone. What is bloody supplies? Move up. Stay with us. He just disappeared. Where's Dutch, Marston? He got away. Uh, scared to shoot him? Too much to handle? When the opportunity presents itself, I'll put a bullet in him. Don't you worry. Won't like myself for doing it, but I'll do it. Ah, good man, good man. You know, at the end of this, you'll probably get a medal. I know I shall. <laughs> he does not deserve a medal in any possible sense of the word. That is, he's a dick. Absolute dick. <sighs> Another mission. Been a busy episode, for sure. Professor! Oh, it's you, dear boy. Come in, come in, and shut the door. What's going on? You leaving? Yes, sir, yes, I am, sir. You know, you know the thing? The thing that is vital, without which scholarship cannot proceed, sir? No, I don't. Not having a bullet in your flipping neck, sir. I am not cut out for this. No, I'm not cut out for this at all. <laughs> nope. They're fucking savages! Savages! I think we all are. Not me, sir. I'm from Connecticut. I'm a professor at Yale. I write books. I do not deserve to die out here. Where's my tincture? Oh, yes. <sighs> You okay, Professor? Oh, dandy, sir. Just dandy. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh great heavens above! Is that you, John? Hello, Dutch. <laughs> I think that's what they call two for the price of one out here in this wonderful place. Maybe so, Dutch. You and, and, and your friend there, the Professor? We're going to kill the both of you. Why you want to do a thing like that? I don't know. Sport, I guess. Fair enough. Uh, why don't I come out there? We fight. Let the professor go and send your boys back to their families. Well, that, that sounds like a beautiful plan, John. Only problem is my boy's here. They already lost their families a long time ago. We aren't thieves, John. We're fighting for something a, a bit like you. Only we're fighting for an idea, not just for ourselves. That's beautiful, Dutch. You always were a fine speaker. I was. Now, would you kindly send that academic out here so we can show him what we really think about the art of anthropology? Please, sir, what are we going to do? I'm going to hand you over to him and watch him tear you limb from limb. What? I'm just kidding. We're going to run across the rooftops. Get you back to your ivory tower. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. Don't thank me. We're still here. Come on. <laughs> I'm going to hand you over. It's like, uh... Ooh. Ooh. Kinky. <laughs> yes. oh, come here. This is slightly gross. Oh, <laughs> Good day, sir. Uh, madam. Look here, sir. What is the meaning of this this outrage? You two stay down and shut up. This way. Let's go then. So I feel like this might be the last we see of the professor. John! Help me, John! Stay back! Where the teacher gets oh, it! Really? Oh! No need for that, is there? Jesus. No? Really? Finally got him. What the fuck? Christ alive! How many are there? We're completely surrounded! There's two over there. Too damn close! You're a damn motherfucker. And you! <laughs> no? 
He's still alive? Oh, he's dead again. Okay. I was gonna say. Stay quiet. Two on this side. And the rooftops are covered right now. You gonna pop up as well? Can't get it. <coughs> Bless me. What's happening now? Stay in cover. All right, reload. Ah. Shot him. I don't think he's dead. He's gonna go back up. I hope he gets back up. I'm gonna finish him off first. Then we can move on to the next rooftop. Oh, he's dead. Sweet. Not quite far. What I might do is go for my sniper. Poke your little head up. Dead. Instant death from this sniper. It's deadly. Which I've got quite low health. That's one there. Oh, right in the neck. On the left. Come on, then. Let's make a break for it. Right, switch to the pistol again. Let's move. Go then. That's it. Down the ladder. Don't drop. You need your, your health to be nice be and high. An alleyway down here. Right, let's go. Alleyway. To the horses. I'll nick this gun. Thank you very much. Hee <laughs> hee. Sniper ammo. That's why he's doing so much damage. Because one hit with that sniper just, just drains your health. All right, get us out of this hell hole. Slow it up. So we're gonna escape that wall. Right to the station. I'm not staying in this place a minute longer. <laughs> Fair this enough. This really couldn't have gone more horribly wrong. It's gone pretty wrong. At least you got some good material for your next book. You know, I dreamt of documenting the last days of the Old West. The romance, the honor, the nobility. But it turns out it's just people killing each other. It always pretty was, much. Professor. And the Old West ain't quite dead yet. Oh, I know, Mr. Marston. Believe me, I know. Where the hell is Dutch, though? Please, oh, I don't know. I'll leave and never come back. Give me Dutch. Oh, you, I knew that was that man. Right, here we go. Leave the professor alone. We're in a dead eye. Ooh. Well. Oh, not what a hit. Come on, the professor come on. down. Oh, the professor's, the professor's being shot. It's hard, it's hard. Try and catch up. Come on, horsey. And that professor is riding quick. Fast. Horse anyway. Woo! Let's go! And the job's a good one. Right, I guess there will be more backup arriving. It's just a, it's just a known thing. Oh, there's more coming. Oh, Lord, yeah. No, Fuck it, it's so off if I was a better. Good. Come on! Keep going, just keep going. I'm going to try and return to him, but he just rid off into the distance. Oh, you're pissing me off now. Finally. <laughs> He's got such a good shot. Love it. Come on. Right. Many times I press the wrong button, so I play so many goddamn games, it gets confusing. Ah, my research is complete. Much as I thought, there's no civilizing this savage land. I could have told you that for nothing. Ah, but they'll give me a prize in New Haven for this. <laughs> well, they bloody better. Well, goodbye, Mr. Marston. Best of luck, dear friend. Wow, awkward. <laughs> so long, Professor. <gasps> so long, sir. Why is he so sad for? It's good that he's going, he's safe. I think. I was hoping we could sell some stuff, but I think the shop might be closed. It's like 4 a.m., so that's, that's, that's quite early. Anyway, thank you guys for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We are slowly approaching the end of this game. It's a pretty big game, but we're getting there. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.